Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode of Tin Plate Dave. I know it's a little weird to be filming on a Tuesday, but I just had to. And you'll see why shortly. So there's my um, post-war Texas Special Magnet Traction in the B unit. I love this train. I just love it. It works so good. It looks cool. But over here we have something else. Something I just recently got that I have to show off. I don't mean to brag, but... That there is a Lionel 9U. Never had one before, always wanted one, but the ones that you can get outside of its original kit box, which cost upwards of $10,000, they're usually crap. But uh, i just been looking and looking, and I found one on eBay. And I got the provenance to it, and I talked to them. It belonged to a train collector who was also kind of a famous person. And uh, it, to me, it looked all original from the pictures. So I took a chance and I bought it because I really wanted one for my collection. And it's true. This is just nothing's been replaced. I just cleaned it up, it had some dust. All the four flag posts are there. Every part of the trim is there. It's fully functional. It's very heavy if you've never felt a 9U. It's way heavier than the 9E. And that has to do for a couple reasons, but for one, it was like the first of its kind, older than the 9E. And it has a different system in there. I don't know if I should talk about it or not. Like, it's just so cool. Anyway, switch is all original, works good. Got a pulling uh, dumpable dump car, 216, uh, 220 uh, spotlight car, 213 cattle car. And uh, 217 caboose. And I got my 384 in neutral right there just hanging out. I just, I had to display this because this is one of my prized possessions now. And it has no problem pulling these cars. In fact, after warming up, it, it speeds up considerably. has all original brushes. I cleaned the armature. You can see the nameplate there, nine. So these came out before the 90s in the you know mid 20s in a full box kit with like a generator and all like belts and all these different things you could do kind of like a, an erector set. Here. There, 
it is. All right, so let's uh, get this one going. This is gonna be a bit risky. I think I'm good enough. Some of that satisfying crackle. Anyway, hope you enjoy.